In my songs, I tend to keep adding sounds till it sounds full, like a real instrumental song. Libraries seem to prefer more minimalistic. Uh, I may be adding too much for their taste. What's your take? Uh, it's such a, you know, you're kind of asking me, what do people like in their music? Who are you talking to? Like, which library? I, I, when you say libraries prefer more minimalistic, some do, and some have parts of their, their tracks that feel more minimalistic. Now, you might be doing something that I did earlier in my career where I stacked up my track way too much. I got It, it was too busy. Like, I was like, I got, in order to make my track sound big, I have to have a guitar and, a, and, and piano and uh, strings and this and that, and I have to have 16 different snares, and I have to have this many different, you know, it was a mess. It was just way too much. So if you're throwing up way too much in your session, that could be so much just too much, right? Not so much that you're not being, um, you're just throwing way too many sounds in there, so it's getting too busy. So I can't tell you that, like they're all going into a minimalistic feel or more into a complex field. Um, but definitely it needs to be, I, I know it's just ridiculous to even say, but it's like, it just has to be the right mix of instruments for the music you're making, right? If you're making epic, huge orchestral music, it's gotta sound full, it's gotta sound big. It's gotta probably have a lot of stuff going on. If you are making minimal tension music, you don't need that much. You just need a couple of things. It needs to be just really well crafted and really well structured and really well written. So it's, you know, it's a hard question to answer, but, um, you might be, I mean, that, that last part right there, you might be adding too much for their taste. That actually might be the truth right there. You just are throwing way too much into your track. It's a common mistake that a lot of producers make is they throw way too much um, to try to get their songs to sound bigger. And it usually just makes them sound more messier. And bigger comes from better writing, from better composing, a stronger chord progression, a stronger melody, and sample uh, selection. Having a really great sounding uh, you know, drum kit, great sounding piano, right? If you have just really great samples um, and obviously you're mixing and mastering skills, you can make your track sound huge with that kind of stuff, right?